All right, guys, welcome back to Homesteading with the Heberts, garage edition this time. What we're going to do is change the thermostat on this 2006 uh, Nissan Sentra 1.8. All right, let's get to it. All right, so things you're going to need for this is you're going to need a pair of pliers and 10 millimeter socket. And obviously the new um, the new thermostat, which we have right here. This is the thermostat housing here. It's got three bolts on it. They're all 10 millimeter. So that we don't lose the, uh, the bolts, I'm going to put them in the box that the thermostat comes in. Now you should drain some of the liquid out of your, uh, your vehicle. What I did is I'm just going to go ahead, I put a bucket underneath that should catch anything that drips out. Alright, so we got the three bolts out. Next thing we're going to do is we're just going to pull this off, which we didn't lose too much fluid, so that's good. I'm going to check the, the rim, looks good. I'm going to pull that out. Can't get it, that's what we need the pliers for. Just going to grab it with the pliers, like this. And we're just going to pull it. Oh, there we go. And we're going to want to make sure that this nipple is up. And we're just going to push that back in. And we're going to put the housing back on. Lost a little more fluid than I thought I would. And be careful with these bolts because you don't want to snap them. They are easy to snap. The bottom one's hard to find the hole. Now that is why we went ahead and we put the, the bucket underneath was to catch all that fluid. Now we're just going to go ahead and tighten those up.
You just want to snug these. You don't want to over tighten them because you will snap them. Alright guys, so that's all there is to changing out your thermostat in a 2006 Nissan Sentra. Um, if you like what we're doing here, please do click that subscribe button um, and leave a comment down below. Thanks guys, have a great day. Bye.